The VFW Member of the Year recognizes a member of the Veterans of Foreign Wars who has exemplified in their actions and accomplishments the true spirit of our organization in serving the needs of their post and community, and who has dedicated themselves in a professional manner to addressing the pillars of our organization. This year's recipient demonstrates each facet of this criteria and more. After retiring from the Air Force, Sarah Lively became, a certified, became certified in advanced yoga practices to support mental and emotional health for military personnel. She opened the yoga studio in 2016, providing free services to military communities and volunteers extensively with Veterans Yoga Project, even donating $25,000 to its foundation. Sarah is highly motive involved in the Boy Scouts of America, serving various leadership roles and volunteering 60 to 80 hours monthly. She also contributes significantly to VFW Post 9675, including making generous donations and overseeing renovations. Her dedication led to her election as Post Commander for the 24-25 year. Alongside her volunteer efforts, Sarah works as a contract training evaluator for the VA and is completing her PhD in self, I don't think I reviewed this, self, because you know, it's one of those words again. Efficacy? Efficacy? That's another word that ain't in New Jersey. I'm letting you know that right now. <laughs> like efficacy and then the next one. They even, they even phonetically put this out. Kinesiology. What the hell is that? <laughs> All right. Efficacy and kinesiology. All right. She balances these roles while raising s seven children. They got cable in Oklahoma? <laughs> Exemplifying her exceptional commitment to both her professional and personal life. Sarah and the work she accomplishes in support of veterans and her community day in and day out serves as a shining example of what it means to be a VFW member. It is now truly my honor to proudly present the 2024 VF, the 2023-24 VFW Member of the Year Award to VFW Life Member and newly elected Commander of Post 9675 in Popopo Poplian, Nebraska. Sarah, Jesus. Sarah Lively. <laughs> National Member of the Year Award presented to Sarah Lively, Sharp A, VFW Post 9675 Commander, VFW Department of Nebraska, in recognition of her exceptional dedication and service and for her outstanding contributions further in the mission and purpose of the Veterans of Foreign Wars of the United States. Her commitment to volunteering, providing free yoga classes to active duty service members, veterans, and first responders at her studio in her partnership with the VA to provide free yoga for PTS, TBI, and chronic pain claim clinic patients has had a profound and lasting impact on the lives of many in the military and veteran communities. As a member of the Nebraska State Governor's Veterans Board, Lively has been the voice for military service members and veterans, promoting veteran initiatives within the state of Nebraska. Her coordination with other nonprofits to host retreats for women veterans and active duty service members, and her role as advancement chair for the local Boy Scout troop and council since 2018, demonstrate her unwavering support for her community. Through her efforts as Post 9675's newly elected commander, the countless hours spent helping renovate her post, her time serving as the point of contact for the local cemetery, and her assistance with buddy poppy drives and support for community ceremonies are clear evidence of her dedication, her unwavering support and commitment to helping veterans and active duty service members 
while also mentoring and guiding the youth into becoming civic-minded, patriotic future leaders has justly earned her the utmost respect, appreciation, and gratitude of the veterans of foreign wars of the United States. In witness whereof, we have hereunto set our hands and the official seal of the veterans of foreign wars of the United States this 30th day of July, 2024, signed by Dwayne Sarmiento, Commander-in-Chief, and Dan West, Adjutant General. All right. Thank you. Sarah, once again, huge congratulations on that. You know, you only do this one time, right, when you're the commander? When the first award winner come up and, you know, they started talking, reading her award, and I'm like, yeah, I guess this is it. Just get him walk off stage. I didn't give her an opportunity to speak and dress the crowd, the member of the year. So I feel like a total ass. So I asked her to come back up here and at least say a few words to the delegation. I think she's earned that right, being a VFW member of the year. Sarah, please, accept my apologies. All right, well, let me start by saying first, thank you to all of my comrades from across the globe. I've had the privilege to run into some of you face to face for the first time, so it's an honor to be here and represent the VFW and all the great work that each and every one of you members are out there doing. It just so happened I was the one to represent all of us, and again, it's an honor. Thank you to all my comrades in Nebraska, I see you. So much love for your support and your confidence in electing me post commander. Um, it's an honor and privilege. Not only did I serve my time in the Air Force for 20 honorable years, <laughs> yes, but it's also an honor and privilege to continue to serve my veterans today. My brothers and sisters, wherever you are, however you serve, I'm here for you. Uh, again, it's an honor and a privilege. And I'm blessed today to have one of my seven children. <laughs> Christopher, who is Junior ROTC and the future of our force. And so I'm very proud we have one daughter currently serving in the United States Navy, surface warfare, and uh, we'll hope to continue the service through our generations to come. So thank you very much. 